in that direction, the cat said, waving its right paw round, there's a hatter. And in that direction, waving the other paw, lives a march hare. Visit either you like, they're both mad. But I don't want to go among mad people, said Alice. Oh, you can't help that, said the cat. We're all mad here. I'm mad. You're mad. How do you know that I'm mad? You must be, said the cat, or you wouldn't have come here. The Black Coat of the Woods by Darren Henley There is a forest locked away from prying eyes, and a place where fog rolls regardless of the weather. You may find it, if you want to. It isn't so much hidden by secrets, but rather by the truths people don't wish to hear. Go into the mountains and walk the trails. Keep walking. It will reveal itself to all who are willing. You will know it by the oaks that raise high into the sky to blot out the sun within its depths. A single path will let you in and a single path will take you out. Light your lantern and walk inside. Shapes will form in the fog as you stroll this path, reminders of past thought and memory. Faces that you think you know will stare at you, blank and void of familiar personal touch. As you continue your way, the silence will be broken by the notes of a single shrill flute it ascends and descends its scale, lulling you further while driving you away. Now it is your will to go on that will determine whether you manage to further your trek. If you do, a cacophony of whispers and chants will float through the fog. They will mount against you, an endless wave which you must overcome. Then they will stop at once as you come to a grove with fewer but grander trees. In the middle, sitting as a Buddhist monk, is the black goat of the woods. All features are hidden beneath his black robe, and upon his shoulders rests the horned head of a goat. At his side, the cracked flute that he played for you rests. In his lap, a book written by him, that contains all that you want to know and all that you don't want to know. Ask as many questions as you like. The black goat will answer them all. But for every answer given, he will tell you one thing you don't want to know the answer to. If you are wise, you will fear them both. Leave whenever you wish, but what has been said will never leave you.